And welcome back to Moon Chronicles. We're going to start playing episode 3. As soon as I hit this, press F7. Go. Oh. Normal. When we last left our hero, he destroyed an alien spaceship and teleported from it. By pushing us button. And we kaboomalated. Well, back into the Lola. Mm -hmm. What? Look at the frame! Frickin' punched! There we go. Fix it. Oh. Sorry, I'm looking at my... Okay, now we're y'all fixed up, yay. Ow! <laughs> Skip. There's some dirt on the screen. Yeah. Mines. Ow. What the heck? Did I back up into one? I have no idea. I must have. <sighs> I hate it when I'm in a rush and I'm st I start playing like crap. Yeah, people. Me getting a job has royally screwed with our recording schedule. When I got a job, it didn't do anything. That's because you only work in the mornings most of the time. By the way, I have a bad habit of missing this tiny little inky dinky thingamadoodad right there. Well, that is easy to miss. Health was so hard. Another map terminal. That means it's gonna be. Oh, it's not selected. Why is it not selected? Because I had to move the frame, remember? Oh! I forgot about that. F7. It's the mapity map! It seems you've survived again, Major King. Perhaps you. Perhaps you'll start trusting me now. I still don't know who, who you work for, what you want, or even who you are. We're ways off from trust. Good, you're still thinking clearly. Being careful whom you, sh whom you trust may save your life. Major, I want you to understand what's really happening on the moon. To do that, you must proceed to the central processing area. The security system is, fu is fueled bleh by three power cores that I have just marked on your map. Turn these off and continue into the, into the facility. Wait, you said I would find my men here. Where the hell are they? Hello? Major, come in. What happened, what happened back at the dish? Sukigami, it's you. We're not alone here, and I'm pretty sure this isn't the liquid talking. <laughs> I was transported onto one of the ships that attacked the Freedom 2 and engaged in direct combat with its occupants. They were alien and hostile. I repeat, this isn't just an automated defense system here. We're dealing with hostile extraterrestrial life forms. My god! My god! <laughs> <laughs> it's finally happened. Listen, Major, I'm still struggling to reestablish contact. Con contact with the general. Maybe she is the answers. Until then, just investigate those new locations and be careful. F7. This is the security thing I'm gonna do there. He's talking about. 
By the way, everyone, our microphone uses a USB cord. Our, our um, capture card uses a USB cord. The same type of USB cord. And occasionally, they need to be switched, apparently. Because, <laughs> like, a ca once in a while, the capture card will say, No device found. So we switch the USB cord, and it works just fine. I don't... It makes no sense, considering that there's nothing wrong with the USB cords. They're just... They just need to be switched from time to time. I don't get it. No one understands except for maybe the attack lamps. You're feeling bad for this lamp. This is because you are silly. It is a lamp. It does not have feelings. Well, it is a lamp robot, but I don't think feelings have been programmed into it. Well, it would be hard to kill people. <laughs> it seems like some kind of teleporter. Uh, F7. Major, what are those things? Matter transporters. Are you being serious, sir? That's how I got onto the vessel and back. What I'd like to know is why someone would need so many of them in one location. F7. Remember what resume means. Mm -hmm. uh. F7. Is that a conveyor belt up ahead? Looks like it, and as a matter of fact, this whole place seems to be one big factory. My god! My god! <laughs> Those are... human beings. This is bad. I've got to find Alpha Team. F7. Whoa, 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 Mr. Lava Lamp Bot. Lava Lamp Bot. Do we got Lamp Bots? We got Lava Lamp Bots? <laughs> We got lamp bots, we got lava lamp bots, come down to the lamp bot emporium. <laughs> Wait, was there a uh... Ah Hello I almost missed you. Mm -hmm. Alien pizza Alien Pizza It'll make you sick. <laughs> this here is alien pizza. Extraterrestrial pizza. <laughs> By the way, this is something rather unintentionally hilarious. <laughs> That's... Although, consider this. That right there is a pile of human corpses. Oh gosh. But that looks like something straight out of Dr. Seuss. Yeah. Dr. Seuss got hilariously dark. Oh, well, he did make war propaganda at one point. I found Alpha Team's exosuits. They, they've been sliced right off. What about Celis and Burton? Suk, I don't think they made it. There are signs of explosive decompression, which if you know anything about space, you know that's not real. <laughs> mm-hmm. Isn't that right, Mark? Yeah. Ironically, that, that technically is not real. That does not actually happen in real life. Mm-hmm. Though you do need heat and air. Mm-hmm. I'm uploading your visual data to General Lambert's escape pod. She's coming through now. Are you seeing this, General? These are Alpha Team suits! My people are all dead! What did you lead us into here? My god! <laughs> <laughs> Every time I read that, that's what I think of. I know, I know people probably aren't going to get that, but watch Phalus. Yeah. That's what I'm going to say. That place, when I sent the scientists in, I had no idea. What? You send scientists in, General? What the hell is going on? It was a calculated risk. When personnel from Alpha Base discovered the facility, I was the first to get the report. I was looking at an unprecedented technology harvest. Here we go, harvesting on the moon again. Yeah. A chance for safety and security forever. We didn't pick up any life signs, so I decided the facility was probably abandoned and instructed scientists, the scientists to investigate. 
instead instead of sending the E T E O in, uh, in the, instead of sending in the E T E O, it's like my brain wants to read it in the way I would say it. <laughs> you had civilian scientists wandering around an alien base, with all due respect, wandering around an alien base. With all due respect, ma'am, that's not just... That's not just a violation of protocol. It's insane. Yeah. I had to break the rules, Kane. I couldn't risk drawing the attention to the facility with a large-scale ETEO deployment. And the technology was just too valuable to risk having a bunch of trigger-happy ET, ETEO grunts running around the facility. No offense. None taken. <laughs> I like the way you said that. Not taken. <laughs> Not taken. The situation got hotter than I anticipated, so I sent your team in to bring things under control. I knew I could trust you to do it quietly. I can't believe this. You ignored basic cro protocol. You withheld critical intel from us, all because you were afraid we'd break some alien gadget? How much more do you know about this place? Nothing. I... Damn. There are more ships approaching. I think I've been detected. My oh, god. There's so many of them, Kane. I need it. I need you to... <laughs> We've lost contact with General Lambert. Her escape pod just disappeared off the radar. Uh-oh, Kane. I'm detecting a fleet of unidentified vessels approaching our location. The captain is correct, Major. Those vessels are full of the troops that you just encountered. These tunnels will soon be swarming with them. You again! You told me I'd find my men here. What happened to them? You've seen all that's left of them. If you had come directly here, as I told you, there may have been time for you to save them. Save them from what? What the hell is going on here? You will find out soon enough. There are hostiles closing in on your position. If you want to live... You will shut down the remaining power cores and move to the central processing area. Damn. Major, I lost contact with you for a second, but my scanners were picking up incoming and outgoing transmissions at your location. What's going on? There's no time to explain. I've got to get out of here. End F7. Ugh, sorry, I thought we the, the game turned into a novel for a second there. <laughs> that was the longest the dialogue I've seen so far. Yeah. How Hello? far how far into a save point? Uh well I can always backtrack to the last save point that I We are at fourteen minutes, just so you know. I think that text was like half the episode. <laughs> Oh, well, my mom did interrupt us for a minute, but just a minute. Well, we interrupt this text with more text! Manipulation. Since the earliest stage of their evolution, subversive st strategies have been used to control the species' cultural development. One tactic has been to introduce... has been to introduce contrasting theologies to the earth to the earth to the earth <laughs> throwing the population into fat into faction factualism and infighting factualism whatever mm -hmm. uh let me look at the map for a smick it Okay, I'm gonna backtrack to the last save point, and when we come back, I'll I'll start at this door here. Okay, see you next time. Toodles, people.